goes on a bit from what I was talking about with objections, really. Um, we need to be able to negotiate with buyers in a way that builds trust. Um, so they begin to trust us as a uh, to use us as a preferred supplier um, and that we can, you know, we can flexibly meet the needs of um, the various buyer uh, market segments that we're in. Um, so having a range of entry points into um, the company to purchase um, is, is really important. So, I mean, a terminology I would use at the minute is down, sell, up, sell. You've got a product. You might be talking to the person that you're having conversations about this particular product. Where does it sit in um, your product suite, as it were, or your service, whether it's product or service, it's the same terminology, but where does it sit? Um, so if you're selling, if you've had an inquiry about your higher price product here or service, then what sits beneath it or beneath that? Do you know, do you, you know, so it's about having that knowledge going into a sales conversation, negotiation about okay, well, look, I understand that, you know, you may not be able to, you know, join us here right now, but we do have this and that we could look at potentially offering that to you for, so that's where you're going to look to do some negotiation. That's where you've got to dig a bit more and find out what, you know, you've got to know what the budget is and you've got to know who the decision maker is and that you're speaking to them or you have access to them. And then you need to position your proposal as it were, to position your offering um, confidently. Um, it's not to talk about giving away things, but it's knowing what your, for example, I mentor a sales team in a small business at the moment. Before they enter into any conversation with anybody, they know exactly what the what price they can offer, um, you know, what price the, the product is sold at or service is sold at, and then the first drop down they can do. They know that. So don't have to go to anybody to say, now, if it's your business, you should, you're should you obviously going to know that anyway. But it's not about rushing to discount. It's about understanding what that person needs and where we can be flexible to create that win because negotiation is all about creating that win. It's about what do they need? What do we want? <laughs> what do we, we want a nice new customer that's going to be a lifetime value customer. You know, I'm sure most of you have heard, you've heard the term loss leader products, loss leader services. Sometimes we offer a loss leader to get that person in through the door. Then we build that relationship with them and then they might refer, they might be caps, refer somebody to us. They could then go on to that product they originally were interested in. So negotiation plays a really important part. It's not about necessarily discounting. It's about meeting them where they're at. So if this is the budget they have, we can negotiate to offer them something there to bring them further in to our organisation to support them further. Am I making sense? Hopefully I am. 